So the question that we have here is a little confusion about major and minor second intervals. And it says, why is a major second interval different from a minor second interval, considering that in the natural scales formula, they are both one whole step? Well, let's take a look at that, actually. Let's use a major scale, for example. Major scale consists of a pattern of whole steps and half steps, or major seconds and minor seconds. So. Uh, everyone should know the, the sound of a major scale. So, whole step, whole step, half step, whole step, whole step, whole step, half step. So, major second, major second, minor second, major second, major second, major second, minor second. So as you can see and hear, there is quite a difference between a whole step and a half step. Uh, or between a major second and a minor second. So a major second is going to be the larger interval and a minor second is going to be smaller. A minor second in the classical music tradition, Western classical music, the minor second is going to be the smallest interval that we can play. It's going to be two adjacent keys on a keyboard or on the guitar here, it's going to be two adjacent frets. So I can't get any smaller than that. So that's a minor second. I'm on the third and fourth frets here. And a major second would be if I played on the third and fifth fret. So we can just hear the difference there. Um, so to answer the question, there is a difference between a major second and a minor second. And that is the minor second is one semitone smaller than the major second. Thank you.